guys so today I wanted to do a really exciting video or a video that I'm really excited to do anyway it is the agave healing oil review and I've wanted to do this for a while but I really really wanted to give this a fair shot and like a long time to use it before I decided what I want to tell you guys and I'm really excited like really 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 excited to bring this to you guys to show you guys how much I have been obsessing with this product you have no idea like no idea so first I'm going to show you the first product that I used out of the line, which was the Agave Healing Oil Oil Treatment. And it comes in a bottle just like this. I got this at Sephora, or at least my mom got it for me, so I can't say how much it costs because I have no idea, and there's no sticker on it. But I know she got the giant one, and she got me this one to try. And I had heard, like, so much crazy, crazy good stuff from people on Instagram, as well as Agave Oil themselves on Instagram. And let me just tell you. Everything you see on Instagram is true. This stuff is amazing. My ends, look at my hair. Look how shiny and like healthy it is. Especially with having the blonde in it, my hair has never ever been this soft. Like it's ridiculous. It's so lightweight. It's so silky. It's amazing. And my hair is really thin, so I was worried about if this is gonna weigh it down or not. But this is actually very very lightweight compared to every other oil I've ever tried, including the um, the macadamia, all those like great ones. So. Um, argan oil, all that stuff. So this is amazing. I'm not... I like this scent. I don't love it. I know there's so many people that like are obsessed with it and think it smells so good. I think it smells okay. Oh, I didn't even show you. So it comes in a dropper like this. So you can see the oil in there. Let me show you. You see how liquidy that is? It's so lightweight compared to the other ones. So I really, really like this. It works really well to repair the ends of my hair. It like, just like, does crazy, wonderful things for your hair. So I put this in when I get out of the shower, leave it in for a few minutes, comb it through my hair before I blow dry. Let it sit for a few minutes in my hair, just so that my hair will absorb it better. So, this is what I'm really excited to show you guys. Shampoo and conditioner. Shampoo and conditioner. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's first start with the shampoo. So, the shampoo. It's really weird. It's hard to describe. It's, it's supposed to, it's like marketed as like an oil shampoo and oil conditioner. So... If you think about it, when you put it in your hair, it's not going to be really, really lathering, which is doesn't bother me. Some people really like that. That doesn't bother me. But it's so strange putting it in for the first time. It For the consistency-wise, it reminds me of the Josie Marion Argan Milk. Because it's creamier like a milk. I don't know if you guys can be able to see. See that? That's what it looks like. So it's like creamy like a milk, and your hair almost like sucks it up. It's so weird. There's like nothing to lather with. You just kind of have to rinse, and you'll see that it comes out. But it's like your hair like absorbs it. It's the strangest thing. I really like it. I, I know a lot, a lot, a lot of people are obsessed with the smell of the shampoo conditioner, and I very much dislike the smell. That's the only downside, I would say. But I tolerate it because it makes my hair, oh my god, this, these two things are like, I love the oil, but honestly, in my opinion, these are the magic makers. And it sounds strange because I've never experienced such a difference in my hair just from the shampoo conditioner. Usually it's like the products itself, like the styling products that will make the difference. But for me, for some reason with this, it's the shampoo and conditioner, which is strange because it has never been that way for me before ever. I've never found a shampoo or conditioner that I loved so much that made such a difference. So I knew right away when I tried these, it was gonna be amazing. Um, so going back to the shampoo. Um, so you, it's, it's not lathering whatsoever. You just kind of scrub it in, rinse it, and it, your hair feels really weird after using this. And then you put the conditioner on, and you're like, what the heck? It's so lightweight. It's not heavy whatsoever, and it's, it's weird because normally I like the really heavy, thick conditioners that I can, like, run my fingers through, get my, feel like my hair's really soft. And using this, it's, I'm trying to explain, it doesn't feel very hydrating at first, and you're, like, running your fingers through your hair, trying to comb it through and stuff, and... You're just like, okay, whatever, let's see how this works. And again, like I said with the shampoo, not as much so, but a little bit. It does like absorb into your scalp, so there's not so much there. It's really hard to explain. It's almost like your hair sucks up like the majority of the products. More so with the shampoo, uh, the shampoo but so, as well with the conditioner. And then as soon as you put your hair under the water, it's like, oh my god, the lights. Like, oh, uh, it's like, hallelujah. I knew right away, as soon as the water hit my hair with this in, that it was going to be like a hair holy grail product. Like, I've never want to use anything else ever again. I know that sounds super, super crazy to say, like, that I knew right away, and that this is, like, my one and only, like, product, and it's really hard to explain. You guys should go to Sephora and get a sample and try it if you haven't, because you're going to love it so much. Um, so 
So anyway, as soon as the water hit my hair, my hair was like silk. Oh my gosh. I wish I could explain it. I wish you could feel this right now. Like silk. Literally silk. It's so strange. So that's it for the conditioner. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, same thing with the shampoo and conditioner. You need a lot less product than you would with another one. And you're going to put it in. And like I said, your scalp will absorb, your hair will absorb a lot of the moisture from both or product from both. So you're going to feel like you need more, but you honestly don't. You need a little bit, probably less than you normally would use. But oh my gosh, you guys, I'm obsessed. So these are the three products here. And I know a lot of people have been talking about them. And I just wanted to get on and let you guys know what I thought about them. And they're amazing. Oh my gosh. Oh, I do know. These are these go for 25 individually at Sephora. I got them at a what is it called? A salon in the mall for 20. And I looked online and the cheapest I could find them was about 19.99, so I just bought them at the local salon. But Sephora does sell them for 25. And I think next time I buy them, I will go there just because you get the insider points for it. So I probably will buy them there. The $5 each doesn't I like the points. Um, so that is it for this review. Go try it. Please, please, please let me know on my Instagram, my Twitter, down below, an email, whatever you want to do. Let me know what you guys think of these. I'm really curious to know what everyone else thinks of them. Thanks, guys.